Rules, rules, rules. Let's talk about rules. As you've probably noticed, we have a rules tab nested in your commission page. Now this isn't just for show, though it does look quite pretty. No, this is a powerful rules engine that can really make your life easier. So I wanna show you how to use it here in your portal. So let's go here to the reps tab and we will have your rules here in this window next to training. And now I'll just show you the rules that are currently applied to you. So you can review these rules, but you won't be able to adjust them. Let's head down to one of your subs and take a look at their rules. Here we have the rules for this rep. Now you can see this person has a couple already implemented. He's got three here for now. There are two commercial rules and a federal rule. And here at the bottom, you have your active rules total commission. Now we can edit the rules or you can add more here, but let's start fresh with a new rep. So let's add a personal volume rule. We'll name it uh, PV1 and it applies to commercial. We'll make the gross adjustment $50. Minimum sample count is one. Max is 500. Now this can go to no limit, but let's keep it lower for now. We'll say the cost of goods will be 30% and this rep should get a commission of 50%. That's a good looking rule. I should also mention that these numbers here on the side are based off this sample data here at the top. This is a reference so that you can test data and see what your commission would be based off of this incoming data. Also, let me touch on this override rule. So when you add a new rule, you have the option to add a personal volume or an override rule. Override rules apply to sister reps only. So if John is my sub rep and he gets his friend Tammy to join my team, I can write an override rule to apply a certain percentage of commission to apply to John from Tammy. So now you have all that done, congratulations, but you might be wondering what's next. Well here in the dashboard you can go to Rep Manager and there you're going to be able to see your commission payout details. See here it is. But where's the rules? Well in order to see your sales reps you have to go back and make sure you select their name and I pay this rep. Once that is selected, then you'll be able to see all of your reps and their applied rules under the commission out. Now this is a great page because it's your commission report. You get to easily see who you have to pay and how much has been generated for this month. Quick note, it will take up to an hour for new or updated rules to make it into the system. So if you don't see your changes right away, nothing is wrong. It will be updated within the hour for you. Here is the rule that we set up together. At the top, you can see all of the gross values of samples, and here you can easily go back and see previous pay periods. Red is the active period, and black is no longer active. So any rules set will be added to the active period, but you can still go back and look at the previous pay periods if you'd like. That's about it, guys. Please explore adding new rules and really get to know this system. If you have any questions regarding this or any section in your sales portal, please contact us here at support at arroyodev.com. Thanks, guys.